I'm Jadine Jefferson. I'm joined here by Jeff Crossman, who's a Democrat running for Attorney General here in Ohio. So give me an idea of your platform and some of the things you want to address. Well, I've been in the State House for uh, two terms now and, uh, quite frankly, disgusted with the uh, lack of, of accountability with all the corruption going on in the uh, Ohio government uh, in Columbus. And uh, we, need to, we need to hold some folks accountable and, uh, for the largest public corruption scandal in the state's history. No one has yet gone to prison, and it's time to change that. And I'm sure voters are frustrated because they're dealing with this, and it's never really the people that actually are responsible that are getting held accountable. So what are some of the challenges that are going to come with trying to win voters over? Well, first of all, we have to educate voters on, on the issues, right? I mean, there's a lot of problems in this state. Uh, we can be number one in the state, uh, in, number one in the country for opportunity, but we can't do it when uh, we're constantly being cheated by uh, uh, you know, scheming politicians or cheated by corporations that have really don't have the, our uh, our best interest at heart. So uh, we need to hold those folks accountable. We need fair districts. We can have competitive districts. We can have uh, politicians actually listen to the voters. That you know, that's a novel idea, right? Uh, but we need that in Ohio. So we can actually have responsive government. So we can have uh, you know a government that actually works for the people instead of the, the people being uh, told what to do by the politicians. The state of Ohio has really gained this reputation for having that just you know just nasty level of corruption going on in our state government. So what is it going to take to hold all those responsible accountable? Well, look, we've had 40 years, uh, absent a few years uh, here and there, of uh, one-party rule. And uh, we need some balance in our state government. Um, you know, the Republican majority has controlled this state, every level of power, uh, for a long time. And they haven't gotten the job done for the state and uh, for the people of Ohio. It's time to change that. And for people that are just being introduced to your campaign, where will they be seeing you around the state of Ohio these next few weeks? Everywhere. Uh, everywhere. Uh, uh, we, I'm based in Cleveland, uh, in Parma specifically, but we've been in uh, Toledo, obviously, today. Uh, we'll be in Columbus, we'll be in Cincinnati, we'll be in Mansfield, we'll be in Youngstown, Steubenville, Lima, all over, Marietta, uh, all over the state. And is there anything else you want voters to know about your campaign? That I'm here for the people. I grew up like uh, most people in Ohio did. I was raised by a single mom who, who uh, we had a lot of hardship growing up. I know what it's like to have no food in the refrigerator and take food from the church. That's why I've always dedicated my uh, my career to helping others. And uh, you know, I think we deserve someone in Columbus uh, like people like them, you know, fighting for them. So that's why I'm running. And this is definitely going to be a race that we're all going to be following closely. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much.